Shabalabao. Shabalabao. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Krusty Cray, yeah, yeah. Yo, what's up, Fox Mask? What's up, Might Be Fog? What is up? What is up? We're just uh, setting up a little stuff here before we get going. What's up, uh, Zoe Lamour? I can't believe I woke you. I'm so sorry. Cloudy C, Bisco. What's up? Actually, Bisco, let me mod you. How do you do that? Mod. Uh, hey, Meepers. I want to mod you, too. How do you mod people? I finished finals today, so can't watch the stream. Hey, congrats on finishing finals. Congrats, congrats, congrats. Very cool, very cool. Uh, how do you... How do you mod someone? How does one mod someone? That is the question. That is the question. Um, let's find out how to do this and then tweet out the link. Have you eaten and had water today? I have, thank you so much. I had a banana, I had some cashews, I had, uh, what else did I have? I had a banana, I had cashews, I had some Miss Vicky's chips, I had a couple, uh, uh, I had a vitamin D gummy, that's how you do it, that's the way you do it. I'm just trying to figure out how to mod people. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> I should have done this beforehand. Oh, okay. Mod and then... It's funny because... Um, I'm gonna be modding... For a stream. For a holiday stream. And I should know how to do this sort of stuff. But... Alas... I do not. <laughs> Okay, uh, chat, I think I figured it out. Okay, perfect. And then, splendid meepers. Thanks guys, yeah, I appreciate it. Um, Fox Mask, you're here pretty often too, so I'll give you mod as well. All right, there we go. We got a few, a few extra mods, thanks guys. Hell yeah. All right, let me tweet this out, and then we'll get the show on the road. What's up, swag gay person? Oh, wait, Splendid, why didn't it mod you? Hey, Path, what's up? We're gonna be playing, uh... We're gonna be playing a cat game. <laughs> also, I'll also, uh, update you about the, um scam ticket situation. <laughs> We're gonna have a little story time. Uh, okay, I just need to mod Meepers. And then tweet this thing out. Splendid Meepers. Oh, okay, already mod. Sick. Thanks for uh, subbing, Zoe. I appreciate it. I do, I do. Playing some cat game and finding cats in Christmas Town. All right, the link's out. So guys, guess what? You're never gonna believe this. We're playing a flippin' cat game. I've been meaning to play this for a while. Let me do a slow fade out on the Kirby music. DJ Mika. All right. Do you guys hear this? Do you hear this music? Hey, Flightless. Are we are we being epic gamers here? Unfortunately, uh, my game capture is not. Okay, perfect. I'm hearing some people say it's too loud, so we can turn it down. Unfortunately, my game capture is not working for this game. So. I'm doing a window capture. I also tried to uh, update. Oh, f I think I just closed the game. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Sorry, my bad. I think I just actually closed the game. <laughs> um, 
I tried to update stream avatars <laughs> so that, do, do you guys see this now? <laughs> Epic Mika moment, yeah, it's very classic for me. I got scammed yesterday, guys. <laughs> we'll talk about that. Very epic Mika moment. Um, <laughs> what's up, everyone? Okay, sick. I tried to update the stream avatars to be cats. Because I wanted it to be... Uh, I just wanted it to be cats, you know? For this game. I'm not going to press that button. That button closes the game. Okay. So, I think how this works is we're literally just looking for cats. And whenever we see a cat, we're just gonna <laughs> we're just gonna click on it. Um, I think someone recommended this game to me on uh, Twitter, but I actually there's a really funny. You already see five. Yeah, I can see a bunch. They all have names. That's so cute. Like this one was named Percy. Hold on. I don't know if you guys see the notification, but. Trot. Ah, This is so cute. <laughs> Hold on. Sam. Yeah. He looks like a Sam. <laughs> oh, you don't see the notif? Okay, I'll make sure to announce every cat we find. This one is Daff. <laughs> we just found Daltos. And Dra Dracon. Dracon? Mika, do you have any pets? I used to have a dog named Toro. Rest in peace. And uh, I really want to get a cat. I'm I'm going through the, the channels. How's my day been? It's been... Ah, I should not have said that. Anyways, this one is uh, OC, so cute. Um, yeah, uh, I saw this TikTok of like this this guy. Yeah, what? thanks for subscribing too much, Ivy. I saw this TikTok of this guy being like, uh, um, oh yeah, when my girl suggests gaming, and then the TikTok just like shows his partner. Uh, just like very like heavy RGB and like very into the game just like looking for cats. <laughs> it's really good. Don't get a fluffy cat if you value not having if you value your clothing not having fur all over. Pedguin, so cute. Uh I do actually I actually don't care too much. I think if there's like hair. I actually love finding like hair on things if that makes sense like if there's someone or something i care about and i find hair on my clothes from them it's actually just like the best feeling in the world thanks for uh subscribing soda pop hearts yeah. honeydew that's so cute Mika, all due respect, that is crazy. Yeah, maybe. Maybe I'm a little crazy. Zephos. So yeah, I uh, I got scammed yesterday, guys. Kind of. It's still developing. But, um... There was this show I really wanted to see. And, uh... I marked, I marked it in my calendar. Because I saw on Twitter who was playing... And I really, really wanted to go, and I was like, okay, I'm gonna get tickets for this. I'm gonna be, like, responsible. I'm gonna be a responsible adult and, uh, mark tickets. Like, get tickets. Also, thanks so much for the hype train. Um, yeah, and then, lo and behold, um, I find out that the concert is today, and I find out yesterday. Was it Sampha? I wish. Actually, we can talk about that Sanfa album after, now that you've listened to it, Path. Um, but it was not Sanfa. I wish it was Sanfa. But anyway, so I go to the <laughs> I go to the venue's site, and I see that this person, all the tickets are like sold out. So I'm like completely heartbroken. I'm like, oh man, that 
actually blows. Rich. We just found Rich. I was like, that sucks. I'm actually uh, very upset and uh, devastated. We just found Ruta. So I, uh, I start doing some Googling because <clears throat> it takes me a while to accept things when tragedy strikes. Aw, oh, Ryan. Hi, Ryan. Um, I, <laughs> hey, Lucy. And Jerry. Sorry, I'm getting distracted by the cute cats. Just scammed me, Gazagas. Feeling good. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, so anyways, back to our scam story. Um, yeah, so I find this website, and it's like, oh yeah, selling tickets. And mind you, the, the tickets are not, they're not, like, cheap, okay? Um, originally, this show, the tickets were, like, I don't know, at most, 25 because they're general admission tickets. Which actually, I, I have another tangent to go on. General admission tickets are actually better. I actually hate sitting at a concert, I realized. Um, <clears throat> I actually really like being on the floor. Uh, sometimes sitting is nice when it's like a chill concert, but sometimes, uh, most of the time, I think 99% of the time, I prefer being on the floor. Why would I trust a random website? <laughs> I don't know. I actually don't. You know what it was? This website had a had a thing that said 100% guarantee. Our tickets are 100% authentic. <laughs> Path, nah, I will be seated. I respect that. I respect that. But you know what it is? It's like when you go to the seated section, everyone stands up anyways. Like maybe it's the crowds. Maybe it's the crowds, but every every time I go to a concert here and I'm in a seated section, everyone stands up anyways. So it's like, I might as well be standing in a place where I can like dance around a little bit, you know what I mean? Because those who know me know I love to dance. I love dancing. Um, yeah, anyways, the tickets, I, I actually sent this to, to Path, like, <laughs> I sent it to Path, I was like, <laughs> oh hey, um, they have a 100% guarantee, it's fine, right? It's fine. Let me pull up the guarantee, actually. Let me read you their guarantee. <laughs> um, <laughs> it was really, uh, in, in retrospect, it was really embarrassing. The guarantee says, it's like a really shitty, <laughs> I can't believe you're admitting this live on stream. Oh, don't, don't even get me started on what you admitted on stream yesterday, if you want, if you want to get down to it. Oh, hey, animal, what's up? What's up? What's up? Glad you can make it. So anyways, it's like this really shitty JPEG of like two documents with like two stars and like completely uncent uncentered, like 100% and then like a guarantee written in like, uh, I don't know, just like this. It's like Arial font. <laughs> and there's a check mark. It's like tickets will arrive in time for your event. You will receive the tickets you paid for or the equivalent. All tickets are valid and 100% authentic. If your if your event is permanently canceled, you will receive full compensation for your ticket. So I was like, okay. I mean, fair enough, right? Like <laughs> you sound you sound really easy to rob. I am. Uh I'm very naive, guys. Aw, oh, Fion. Actually, chat, if we find any cute cat names in here, I'm gonna say them all. But I think we should keep a running list of, like, things that I could name my cat if I get a cat. Esme. So cute. Here's the rules. If, if it speaks to me, I'm gonna write it down, and then we'll go after it at the end, and we'll pick the best ones. And it'll be in the running for, uh, for the cat top model. Mika, I have tickets for you 100% real. Send me all your money. You know this would work on me though, right? Like, I would actually do that. No. <laughs> cinnamon. Aw. I wanna write down Cinnamon. That's a cute name. <laughs> Anyways, so yeah, I, uh... I got completely scammed with these tickets. Um... 
I buy the tickets, right? I do it anyways. Uh, and they send me this like email immediately. Oh, okay, so I gave them my address. I gave them my name. Um, I gave them my credit card. Uh, I gave them my social ins insurance number as well. They said they needed that for the, um, they said they needed that to like send it to me. No, I'm kidding about the social insurance number, guys. I'm joking about that. I'm actually joking. I'm joking. <laughs> but I did give them my address, my full name and my credit card. I actually did that. Um, I actually did that. I'm ashamed to admit. Anyways, the tickets originally, they were like $25. And, uh... Ooh, Craig. <laughs> I bought them for... 55 so that should have been red flag number one right anyways I do some digging and uh, I find out they have a website on Better Business Bureau and I call uh, I look up the website and there's just like comment after comment after comment after comment that is like uh, it's like oh yeah my tickets didn't get here um, my tickets didn't arrive on time. And in the email, they're like, uh, yeah, I do digging after, right? It's, <laughs> thanks for all your personal details. You're a totally legitimate tickets and are not just QR codes for a Rickroll video. Yeah, we'll get into that. Um, <laughs> that would actually be so fucking funny. Like <laughs> if someone sent me QR codes <laughs> for a Rickroll, I would actually just cry laughing. Like I couldn't be mad. I couldn't be mad. It's like, okay, you got me. Fair enough. I'd be probably, I'd probably be pretty sad after, but it would be kind of funny in the moment. Like I could laugh it off before I cry myself to sleep. Uh, <laughs> anyways, um, <laughs> clearly the elites just want to keep all the cheap tickets to themselves. Keep, keep entering that info, King. Will do. <laughs> um. Ah, oh, Duncan. Anyways, they, um, they, what am I going to say? Oh, there's another one. Nilesy, cute, and Nina, so cute. Um, okay, yeah, they send me this email that's like, uh, um, your tickets will arrive, like, the day of, or, like, within an hour of, like, buying the tickets. I'm like, okay, that's kind of weird. Oh, and they also sent me an insurance certificate because I bought $10 insurance on the $50 resale tickets. Because that makes sense, right? So they sent me, like, a confirmation code for my insurance. Um, anyways, so, uh, yeah, I do some research on Better Business Bureau, and <laughs> they're like, this, is, this site is a total scam, guys. I didn't get my tickets. <laughs> the more you say, the worse it gets. Yeah, I bought the insurance. <laughs> the story is just sad. It's gonna make me cry. <laughs> Guys, you can't leave me alone with these kinds of things. I am, ext I am extremely naive. I am very vulnerable. I'm a vulnerable person. I'm a minor and I'm neurodivergent. Um, anyways. So they, uh... <laughs> Everyone on the <laughs> got scammed off scamming insurance. So true. Everyone on Better Business Bureau is like, I didn't get my tickets. I didn't get my tickets. But here's the first silver lining. The first silver lining, because it's not. It can't be a tragedy. I will not let this be a tragedy. <laughs> this is like sending money to Arabian princes on Yahoo. No, it's not. It's different. It's like buying tickets with insurance. I bought the insurance. Okay. <laughs> no wonder why Astro is always so worried for him. Miko, can you PayPal me 100 for monitor and sure drop your PayPal? Um, okay, so on Better Business Bureau, they're all like, uh, they're all like, oh yeah, um, we have looked into this issue and the issue was resolved. Or like, oh, we looked into this issue and the seller did end up getting their tickets. Ravs, so cute. Rhiannon, cute. Uh, oh, Rimmy. Um, okay. So I'm like, okay, maybe there's like a little bit of validity here, right? Like surely it can't be all bad. Um, so I text Path once again, uh, and I'm like, uh, Path, should I call them? 
and uh, I don't even wait for them to respond. I just call them immediately. Um, and later I see Path is like, do not call the scam site to verify the scam. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, Path. Um, I should have waited. But it was like, I sent the text and then like 20 seconds later, I just, I just called them. I was like, I'm just going to do it. So this guy uh, picks up the f no. First, it's an automated voicemail. Second, silver lining, they do, they do have my uh, concert information. They do have the concert information, and they're like, "Oh, I tried to warn you. Yeah, you did. To be fair, the, okay. They they did have my concert information. They're like, "Oh, you're seeing so and so on this and this day. It's like an automated voice, whatever robot." <laughs> I'm like, yeah, that's true. And then I like follow the channels to, um, to talk to like a real person. Anyways, so I get to talk to a real person and it's someone with like a very thick accent. It's a very, very, very thick accent. Um, like in retrospect, it seems like they're in a call center pretty much. Um, and uh, he's all like, oh yeah, um, I just need to confirm your tickets. Uh, what's your name? So I, I give them my name. They're like, okay, uh, what's your phone number? I give them my phone number. What's your email? I give them my email. What type of accent? Like a Spanish accent. Mika, scam callers will literally record your voice lines to get access to your bank account. Never say yes or no. Oh, okay, yeah, I did say yes or no multiple times. Uh, whoops. <laughs> I guess I'm going to have to be checking my bank account. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna have to be checking my account, I guess. <laughs> Anyways, maybe I'm on pure cope right now. Ooh, Chiquita. <laughs> Esme again. Uh, Sammy. Okay, yeah, so, um, the guy is like, yeah, sometimes it takes like an hour uh, <laughs> Mika, you did everything you shouldn't do, Bestie Bear. I, I made a mistake. Did school not, uh, give you basic cybersecurity? No. No, they did not. I usually, uh, <laughs> I usually just wing it. I usually just raw dog life. Um, <laughs> it must have been weird when they asked you to say yes, withdraw $50,000. Should I be saying this on stream though? I don't think I should be saying this on stream if someone can just like Right like I shouldn't be saying these things. I should not say yes on stream ever Too late, I guess. Yeah. Anyways, um He's like give it an hour an hour comes and goes the tickets never arrive <laughs> Uh, Fast forward to this morning guys, I did get the tickets I did get the tickets in my email address. I did. And you know what? There is a QR code. Let me pull up the tickets. I got the tickets, guys. It's uh, it's an e-ticket. It's an e-ticket, guys. And, um... Oh, where did it go? Okay, I'm downloading them again. So... I don't know what, uh, I know about Admit One, which is like, they're like a, like a concert, um, they're like a, uh, they're, they're like kind of like Ticketmaster, right? Like Admit One. So, everyone is saying do not show them. Okay, I'm not gonna show them, don't worry guys. I'm not gonna show them, I'm not. <laughs> Show me the QR code, I totally won't use it. Smile. You're trolling me. Anyways, um, yeah, there are QR codes. I'm investigating them right now. I don't, does this happen on QR codes where if you like zoom in a lot, there's like a little pixelation? Does that happen for QR codes? There's also a barcode um, that does have numbers. But like when I zoom in a lot, it does pixelate a little bit. Um, 
Yeah, it's really sad because it shows you the value of the ticket. On the ticket, it's twenty dollars, and I paid fifty. Um. Yeah, I I feel like since it's admit one, it's like. <laughs> you have lost your internet rights, hand them over. Anyways, I feel like since it's admit one, you know, fingers crossed. So I'll keep you guys posted on the next stream. We'll continue this story time. Vince. Gizmo. That's a cute cat name. I love Gizmo. Um, Fawn. Aw. I'm gonna write down Fawn. I like that one. Um... Yeah, the concert, the doors are exactly when Sleep Deprived stops recording. And I have to show up, I have to leave like right away pretty much. Like I have to get there like almost immediately. Because the, it, it uh, yeah, it's going to be like a little tight. And uh, I'm just trying to, Mr. Tabs. Charlie. Um, the cat meows don't sound like cats, it just sounds like one guy meowing on the mic. So true. <laughs> but this game is so good. Uh, oh! Nigel. We're always making plans for Nigel. Meow. Uh, yeah, so I'll let you guys know. Because I'm going to have like maybe 10 minutes at most to figure out if the cats are real or the tickets are real. And uh, if they're not, I'm just going to be driving somewhere for the sake of it. Making plans for Nigel is such a good song. Yes. Uh, XTC, I think. Everyone check out Making Plans for Nigel. Or Nigel, I think is just the song called. Brother, don't meow into the mic. Dude, I actually... Uh, Brienne. I actually... Um, I meow to every cat I see, and I don't, I don't give a shit. I actually don't care what people think, Fion, aw, Isaac. I actually just do not care what people think if they see me being weird meowing, G-Star. Um, because you know what? If the cat is giving me attention and meowing at me, it means it wants to talk to me. Like cats don't, they don't usually meow to each other as far as I know, Greg. They just kind of meow to people. Harry. So I make sure to meow to the cats. And <laughs> just like barking is. I didn't know about that. I didn't know barking was for humans. Martin. Mousy. Ryathan? Ryathian? Uh, Matt. All right, guys. I have a feeling it's gonna start getting complicated the more cats we find. Mark. Mm -hmm. Xylus. Dorito. Ah, oh, I'm gonna write that one down. That one's cute. Dorito. Adorable. Going home from college this weekend to see my cats. I'm so excited. I'm so happy for you. Bailey, Claire, Hastings, Pam, Columbo, mm. Brenda, Bernard. I think you can zoom in. Yeah, you can, but the uh, achievements are blocking me now. Keith. Can I be honest with you guys? I actually do not like the name Keith. Candace Mary. Meckins? That's cute. Callie. Sparkles. Aw, Sophie. Also, what did Keith do? I don't know. I just don't like that name. It's very, like, uh... I just don't like it. Unfortunately, I want to name my next cat Uranium. That reminds me of that one Brockhampton lyric that's like something, something Uranium, something with my cranium, something, something. Also, you know what, guys? I think we're going to we're gonna put on our original 
music because I feel like uh, the cat music can get a little repetitive and I want everyone to not feel that repetitiveness. We're putting on relaxing Kirby music to fall asleep to. All right. We're back. We up gamers. Smithy. Spiff. Murphy to fall asleep to at 2 p.m. <laughs> hey, you need everyone's got to fall asleep at some point. Mochi. See, I would write down Mochi, but I think that Mochi is one of the most overused cat names. For a good reason, right? It's super cute. But I think that mochi is just, it's, there's too many mochis. It's like the, uh, it's like the, um, <laughs> white guy with a cat named mochi. Yeah, it's like the, I don't know, it's, um, what's a really common human name? Like, uh, John. Not to say there's anything wrong with John, either, you know. Sally, Amanda. I'd name my cat Grungulus. I love that. True, I have a very common common name. Milo. Sarah Sarah. This one was funny. This one was just a guy going like <laughs> like screaming into his mic or something. Sh shadow Shadow at noon? Damn, that cat name goes hard. <laughs> Why did bro meow like that? Yeah, he was like, meow. Mango. Meow. Luke. Meow. Meow. Lollip. Meow. Lewis. Have you guys seen that uh, TikTok of um, the Halloween decoration? Uh... It's like this, like, skeleton or something. <laughs> and he's just like, My name is Lewis. <laughs> I am not a jack-o'-lantern. My name is Lydia. We just unlocked Lydia. Meow maxing. Joe. So cute, so cute. Little Joe, Little Joe, Sleepy Joe, Sleepy Joe. Anna. Becky. I kind of like that one. Uh, Becky with two Ks. But I think we can make it better and just name it Brecky. Naming your cat after breakfast. So original. Alistair. We just found cat number one. This is the original cat, guys. Should name a cat Brick. Oh, we found Alex. Bricky. I think Brick is a great name for a cat. It's kind of hilarious. I want to write that down. <laughs> wasn't uh, wasn't Brick the name of a movie that Joseph Gordon Levitt was in? Potentially also directed by the guy who did Five Hundred Days of Summer. What a neck. Oh no no. Uh, the guy who did, um, uh, Ryan Johnson. Thank you. Yeah, him. That was Brick. Dude, Joseph Gordon-Levitt is so handsome, though. Katie. Adorbs. Kim. Oh, there's one. Josh. Leroy. Sylvester is a good name for a cat. Yeah, I used to uh, hyper. I used to quote Sylvester the cat a lot yeah. when I was a kid. Jack. Yeah. Oh. Do, do, do. Ben. Adorbs. Okay, it's starting to get a bit more difficult, guys. It's starting to get a bit more difficult. I'm gonna need all eyes on deck. Biha. So cute. 
Remy. That's a good name for a cat. You know what I think we're also going to do after this, guys? We're going to play a little bit of Undertale. Just because I'm in an Undertale mood. Yesterday, I was... Uh, when Pav was streaming, I was l listening to a lot of the Undertale music. Yeah, so we're gonna continue with my pacifist run after this. And you guys are gonna have to help me because I was cheating a lot. I was like Googling and I don't wanna do that anymore. <laughs> Boba. Who's your favorite Undertale character? So far, um... So far, I like, uh, what's his name? Um, well, Muriel is cool. Love her. What's, uh, what's his name? Papyrus. I like Papyrus. He's just a bonehead like me. Simon Clark. See you later, Bisco. Thanks for stopping by. Oh yeah, Toriel. Thanks. I'm really bad with names, by the way. What? Chonky. Okay, we've got ten cats left. Pepper. Nine cats. Nine cats left. Can we do it? I don't want to have to, like, spam click everywhere. I love the name Simon Clark for a cat. I agree. Simon Clark is, uh... It's actually just really funny. <laughs> I'm kind of obsessed with the idea of, like, giving your cats just, like, really long, like, long, uh, almost royalty names, like Napoleon Bonaparte or something. Simon Clark, Member of Parliament of the United Kingdom. <laughs> um, yeah, like, I wanna, if I'm not making the, the insurance agent laugh, Tommy, registering my cat, then I don't want to pick a name. I want a name that's gonna make them laugh. <laughs> um, surely there are more cats around. Don't call me Shirley, Shirley. <laughs> Gosh, sure. Uh, oh, that's cool. You can move the little snowman around. Do you have a cat picked out yet, or still in the planning phase? Um, I actually took a trip to an animal shelter recently, just to... Ross, to get a lay of the land. And there was an adorable um, tuxedo cat there named Felix. And they actually encourage you to rename the cats, because it's like, emphasizing fresh start. But the problem is, I'm actually gonna be away from the 21st to the 25th. I'm not gonna tell you where, cause that would be weird, right? But I just kind of decided it's not really a good idea, I don't know, to like bring a new guy home and then he's trying to adjust to the environment and then I disappear, you know? <laughs> Lol, don't leak your address more to the scammers, please. No, trust us, we will not scam us. I actually, uh, getting my my diagnosis, getting my autism diagnosis was like super helpful in understanding why I am so naive and like overly trusting. Apparently that's just a thing. You trust the scammer more than you trust chat? <laughs> yeah, uh, you're right actually. I'm gonna tell you guys exactly where I'm going, where I'm gonna be and what time I'm gonna be. <laughs> Wherever you're going, have fun. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, the psychologist I was working with was like, uh, do people take advantage of you? Um, I was like, hmm, well, I guess there have been times, but it's like, I've never noticed. It's like, people have told me I've been getting taken advantage of. He's like, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Did your parents like tell you a lot about like what you should or should not do in certain situations i was like um yeah i mean there were moments where i like was gonna do something and my parents were like no zoe so cute um there's six cats left i want to find these cats guys because i want to get to undertale
Well, this game is adorable. I think we're gonna play it um, another version of it another time. There's a Paris version. Who was in Paris? Cats was in Paris. <laughs> oh heck yeah. Yeah, there's actually seven, I believe, seven versions of this game. I believe there are seven. Does anyone see any cats? A lot of my, a lot of my friends are in Paris right now. Hell yeah. It's a beautiful city. It's a beautiful city. We love to be there. We love to be there. Um. For left tree. Cat in tree. Oh, thanks guys. Bokoen. Bokoen. Fence on the left. Fence on the left. Fence on the left. Path, is this how you felt when people were telling you where the guy on the building was? Like that you had to assassinate the window cleaner? Top window cat. Top left, she's chilling. Window cat, top left. Window cat. Middle... <laughs> this is so out of context. Yeah, well, we said I said I would cl clip and take out of context. Oh, this one. Thank you, guys. Isp. You know what? You guys are really helping with the cats. I feel like... Uh... Oh. Hell yeah. Thank you. Boof. B-O-U-P-H-E. Boofy. I love that. I'm gonna write that one down. Uh... You guys are so are so helpful with me finding these cats. I think I will give you my uh, credit card information. Path was right. I have to trust chat more than I trust scammers. Hmm, okay. Three more cats, guys. Where do we go? Okay. We checked the fence. We got the fence one. Top left roof. Top left roof. Like, oh, thank you. Pierre. Hell yes. Mika, can I buy a cat with your credit card? You cannot buy one, you can adopt one. Genuinely, if someone wants to adopt a cat, I would like... Mika, I swear to God, if your head is hiding a cat, I'ma lose it. What if I've been a cat this whole time, guys? Can I adopt Mika? <laughs> Only if you uh, give me a place to sleep and feed me three square meals a day. Hmm. Top right chimney. Is that a cat or am I being scammed? Top right chimney. Yeah, I thought this was a cat too. <clears throat> this one scammed me. Is there one in the rocks? Do we have to zoom in? No. Hmm. Turn off chat from the screen for a sec in case we're missing some there. Oh, great idea. This is why they pay you the big bucks. All right, guys. I'm sorry. We're gonna have to banish you for a second. Love a good cat, but you def give off more dog vibes. Thank you. Uh, I love dogs too. I don't want to give people the wrong idea. I don't know if I'm a golden retriever or if I'm a German Shepherd or I don't know what kind of like dog I am. But I was thinking about this recently. You give off white cat vibes. I'll take it. I'm a wise old beagle. <laughs> Chihuahua. Ah, uh, yeah, I heard about Chihuahua guys. You give off squirrel vibes. You're a lab if you're a dog and a brown cat. You are so golden retriever coated, but also Snoopy coated. I feel like Mika would have a cat that is typically really full of itself, but is actually sweet around Mika. 
I have a soft spot for for uh, people and animals that seem a little grumpy on the outside, but are just the sweetest people to you, and in general, the sweetest people once you get to know them. I feel like every person has an animal that they really resemble. I agree. Some actors use this technique when they try to embody a character, they pretend to be a certain animal. That, uh, are you by chance referring to Jared Leto maybe being like an absolute goblin, sending used condoms to people on the set of uh, uh, that one DC movie? He must have been being a rat. Actually, no, rats are cute. I don't want to compare him to a rat. He must have just been being a goblin. Oh yeah, Path, you didn't hear about this? He was, uh, was quote-unquote method acting. Yeah, he was method acting, and uh, one of the things he did was he sent, like, like the most disgust, like, he sent dead rats to people, um, just, like, the most vile stuff. Yeah, I actually have so much beef with uh, people who are like, I'm method acting, I'm method acting, but then really they're just being, like, a total dick. Method act on this, asterisk sticks up my middle finger. Ooh, this song might make me tear up a little bit. I used it in my Toro video. Hide PNG tuber for a sec now. Thank you, thank you. I'm hiding. I disappeared. Yeah, this song is really, really pretty, really beautiful. <laughs> Mika is dead. We don't have object permanence here, guys. <laughs> Actually, I found out about this thing called, um... I'm stumped. Yeah, me too. Hold on, let's really just... Let's rapid fire click. I found out about this thing called emotional permanence. Oh! Hello? <laughs> Who's this cutie? Totes adorbs. Oh, I don't think we were supposed to see that. <laughs> oh, it's snowing. Santa's coming by. What did I do? Is it because I turned the lights on? He's a cat! He's a cat! Why can't I click him? Hello? Santa cat, please! Please! It's not working. I guess this was just like a little bonus, you know? Santa Cat didn't count. Uh, huh. Suddenly I understand that TikTok where it was like when my girl wants to game and then it's just this. But this is getting intense. This is what separates the children from the adults, guys, is being able to find these last two. <gasps> oh! Simon. Got him. Okay. Uh, what is emotional permanence? Okay, so there's basically this thing like object permanence, which maybe you guys have heard about, but it's like uh, Simon and Simon Clark. Yeah, you should uh, adopt a, bo a bonded pair and name them Simon and Simon Clark. <laughs> That'd be so cute. Um, what was I gonna say? Uh, um, 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 oh yeah, object permanence. So it's like, you know, you like hide a, you like hide a ball or you show a baby a ball, right? And then you like put your hand in front of it and suddenly it's like, where did the ball go? Cause it doesn't understand that the ball is still there. It thinks the ball is actually gone. It's the same reason why you can play peekaboo with babies and they will think you actually just disappeared and you're just like appearing out of the ether. So that's object permanence. So with emotions, apparently this is very common for people with like, who are neurodivergent is like, you oftentimes don't realize that just because someone is not like, you know, saying, oh, I love you. Or like, just because they're not like constantly reassuring you uh 
you kind of like don't know how they feel about you. Does that make sense? So if if you like uh, if let's say for example you're in a relationship with someone and yeah there's a name for that but you also need to make sure that you're like differentiating between like an anxious attachment and object permanence but anyways so uh or sorry emotional permanence so it's like it's like people who who don't struggle with emotional permanence they just like you know leave for like a business trip for a week it's like everything's cool they don't think anything has changed between them and their partner but then someone who struggles with emotional permanence they might they might not like what if there's no internet like what if their partner had to go to like a month-long uh mission in antarctica right so they are like oh actually i don't know how this person feels about me even though they have been like totally loving totally kind the entire like i don't know 10 years they've been together it's like oh actually because i'm not getting reassurance from this person like it's like the ball has has disappeared like someone has put a hand in front of the ball you know what i mean and yeah it can be tied to anxious attachment so that's a little bit of about emotional permanence. I don't know how we got on the topic. But found it. it two roofs attached to each other. Bottom right, it's between the roofs and a small triangle. <gasps> da, 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 da. Two roofs on the bottom right. Bottom right, bottom right. Two roofs? Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, great eye. Holy moly, how'd you find that? Okay. Two, there's two roofs attached to each other bottom right are you guys seeing it two roofs two roofs attached to each other in the bottom right two roofs attached to each other too far right I see it everyone sees it but <laughs> right our bottom right it's towards the middle more okay <gasps> oh Guys, we did it. Thank you so much, chat. Randy. Wait, where'd they all go? Oh cool, we got a little we got a little surprise. Wee! Open the pit! Can we get a mosh going in chat? <laughs> <laughs> we did it guys. Jingle Jam 2023. Thank you so much for helping me. Could not have done it without you. <laughs> Exclamation point mosh. I wonder if I can program that myself. <laughs> Just have the Pokemon like make a little space in the center of the in the center of the stream. And then everyone like everyone who joins just like is in the pit. Okay, anyways, cool. Alright, sick. Guess what we're gonna play now, guys. Guess what we're gonna play now. We're gonna play a little Undertale. Undertale. And we will be using the Undertale music for this one. We will be using the Undertale music for this one. Do, 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 do. Okay, uh, can I skip this? Cause I do have a save file, but for some reason it's, uh, oh, there we go. All right. Give me a second, guys. Uh... Ooh. How far did you get before? I'm gonna have to turn this down on the mixer. How far did I get before? Um... It was... After the... Dogs. Thanks, yeah. I, I figured it was a bit... It was a bit too loud. It was after the dog couple. But I'm wondering if we should start a new playthrough for this stream. Because now that I'm thinking about it, do they refer to the name that you typed in for your save file? Do they refer to you by that name? When was that? Um... This was around late May, early June. 
I the reason I started playing it was because I remember Path you were telling me that it was one of your favorite games. So I was like, okay, I need to check it out. Um Are you a from software engineer? I am actually. Okay, so I'm wonder I'm thinking guys, if we can have if we can have multiple um I don't think we can have multiple save files, but I think we have to make a new save file, actually, because I don't want to dox myself. So, yes. Also, let me stream this little game. Let me see if I can get it to work. Um, bum, 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 bum. I think I might have to do a window capture as well. Oh no, wait, maybe I can do a game capture? New save. Let's do a new save. Right after I add this new source. Make sure not to show the old file that has your name in it. Oh, 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 thank you so much. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Thanks, guys. I just saw my name disappear. That was kind of surreal. Okay, uh, capture specific window, Dundertail. Capture Dundertail, please. All right. Moment of truth. I hope I'm not gonna, uh, I'm gonna close my settings so that it doesn't show my full name. Can everyone close your eyes while I test this? <laughs> Can everyone just close your eyes for a second? Okay, that did not work. I think we're gonna have to do a window. We're gonna have to do a window, which is fine, which is fine. We're just gonna have to do a new window capture. Thanks for bearing with me with these technical difficulties. <laughs> Mika trusting the scammers a lot today. Guys, all I do is trust scammers. Undertale. Beautiful. Okay. Does this work? Why is it a white screen? Hello? Best streamer of the year award. Transition screen. <laughs> hmm. Surely there's a way to do this. Oh wait, do I have one game capture? Okay, I should delete that. Why did part of the tra Guys, new streamer, be nice. Uh, part of the transition screen got erased because this is a white screen <laughs> for some reason. For some reason, Undertale is just white screening. Okay. Um, nope, that's me. Bring me back. Okay. Is there a way to full screen Undertale? Maybe that what is what needs to happen. You know what I mean? Um, oh, this is like watching your substitute teacher trying technology. <laughs> yeah, guys, welcome to Zoom 101. Um, this is my first time. Uh, welcome to Psychology 101. This is my first time teaching this lecture. Um, I actually just finished my PhD. Um, I'm wondering what if I... This might be really, this might be insane of me, but what if I share my flipping screen, but I just like put like a, I just like put an overlay to block everything out that isn't Undertale. Is that insane? We're going to try it. I just took a screenshot. Hold on. We're actually trying this. Okay. This might be the dopest thing I've ever done. This, if this, if this, if I can pull this off. Okay, wait, I actually don't know what is the screenshot and what is my actual screen now, I'm confused. <laughs> Maybe you can work on this off stream. Where is the adventure in that path? If my, if my middle name isn't 
get is if my middle name isn't easily scammed. Okay. We're just making a little box. Hope you guys are enjoying this little chat thing. Maybe don't risk a dox. Hmm, I think I could do this. I think I could do this. I just have to like color the whole screen. I love adding a little danger to my screen, my stream guys. <laughs> Famous last word. Please don't make me have to edit the VOD because you doxed yourself. Hey, oh, thanks for the bits, Mr. Dwip. Hey, it's me, Mr. Dwip. Did you hear me screaming in your dreamscape last night? Why didn't you help me? They tore my skin off. I have no skin off now. I did hear a lot of screaming in my dream last night. Actually, I had a very, I had very, uh, I woke up and it was one of those dreams where I'm like, uh, it's called we do a little doxing. It's called we do a little doxing. I'm just uh, trying to color the whole thing, guys. Bear with me for a second, for a moment, if you will. Doing some coloring. Da -da -da -da. So, uh, how's your how's your Thursdays going? <laughs> what are you using for the little guy PNG? This was um, animals. Uh, um, a VTuber that they made me that path commissioned me. It's a very special thing to me. It's very special. I think even if I got like a really cool upgraded rig at some point, I would just not change it because I'm just sentimental like that. I'm actually just like a little sentimental like that, guys. And actually this little VTuber means more to me than my bank account which is why I'm so easily scammed. Maybe we should put on some music while we're coloring so you guys don't get too bored. It's actually perfect. It's like a, <laughs> it's, it's like elevator music. <laughs> I'm having the worst Thursday, the only good part of today's your stream. I'm sorry to hear that, swag gay person. I'm really sorry to hear that. I hope we can make it a little bit better for you. Thanks for coming by and stopping to stopping to chill. I'm really sorry though. You should give Animal your credit card information. Actually, Animal, you got close to getting my credit card information because when I was paying you for the uh, PNG tuber that I commissioned for uh, like for Path when we did our stream. Uh, yeah, I bet you didn't know this, right? But uh, when I go through PayPal, sometimes it's like, um, it's like, oh, give me your, it's like, prompts me to send my like shipping details and like my full name as well, which is really weird, right? And sometimes I, uh, sometimes I like forget to <laughs> turn that off. Actually, yeah. Splendid, uh, I, I, I was, so Splendid and I are working on a top secret project, which I won't share more about right now, but, um, sp uh, Splendid, um, same, same thing. Like, I almost completely doxed myself to you. Yes, guys, it's a secret, it's a secret project, I don't talk about secrets. I don't talk about secrets. I don't talk about secrets. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. I actually love... I love secrets. But only... But only... With the right people. This feels like Mika gossiping. Oh, if only you knew. If only you knew what hot goss I have. <laughs> okay. So we're gonna bring in... This, I named it, uh, I tried to name it Screen Cover. It came out as Screeb Kiver for some reason. Okay, do you guys see this? Does it look as shitty as I think it does? <laughs> okay. <laughs> 
This is so good. Okay. <laughs> yes, it looks bad. It looks scuffed, but it works. <laughs> what is this? It's amazing. <laughs> Okay, so here's what we're here's what we're gonna do. This is where the danger comes. Okay Now we're gonna do now we're going to the highway to the danger zone. We're going to do a capture of a Display we're gonna do a display capture Everyone close your eyes and look away. I don't think there's anything on my screen that can dox me right now. But this is going to be top of the stack, this display capture. I am scanning thoroughly. There is absolutely nothing that can dox me. Wait, did you try to make it full screen? How do you make it full screen? You can make Undertale full screen? How do you do that? Hello? <laughs> Wait. Uh, okay, any, every, anyways, everyone close your eyes. Close your eyes. Okay, boom. Mika, this is sad to watch. Oh, I know. I know. Okay, how do I do this now? Surely there's a way to crop, right? <laughs> Can you crop? You cannot crop. You cannot crop, okay. You know what I have to do? I have to make, I have to make the, I have to make the screen cover a PNG. I have to make the screen cover a PNG. But first we're gonna try full screening, Undertale. It's called We Have a Little Fun. <laughs> It's called We Play With Fire. <laughs> this hurts to watch. <laughs> okay. We're back in, we're back. I made it quieter immediately. Okay, settings. Let's figure out how to, how to full, we're, we're a little silly on Thursdays. Okay. So settings. I only have like, English settings, like language settings. I actually don't know how to full screen it. Hmm. Let me think. Hmm. Mika, I was promised cats, what the hell? I am a cat. This is cat be- this is pure cat behavior. Everyone close your ears, it's gonna get loud for a second. Okay. I think we're just gonna PNGify. We're gonna PNGify it, guys. This is all we can do, right? At the end of the day. Okay. There we go. We're gonna be playing small screen. I'm gonna take the screensaver. And now we're gonna erase the middle part where Undertale was. Why can't I do that? Edit and paint. Maybe that's what we have to do. Yes, now it'll be a PNG. Okay. Now we're cooking with gas, huh? Look at us, huh? Who would have thought? In MS Paint, yeah. In MS Paint. I have to be a bit more precise this time. I was doing some online banking earlier, so I have my online banking details on the screen. Okay. Gonna erase that. We're making a little... Now we're cooking electric. <laughs> For full screen, try Alt F4. Oh, thanks Pandora. Think, didn't you think about closing it before streaming? Why would I do that? It's in a different tab, <laughs> obviously. <laughs> Come on, guys. Like, what? <laughs> oh, thanks for the bits. Hey, it's me again, Dr. Dwip. As I sit here trying to think of something weird and sociopathic to say, I realize we aren't so different, you and I. When are you going to tell everyone what you did? It's time to stop running, give yourself in, it's time to rest. 
You know the, no, I'll tell them. You know the Cheetos um, pizza pause? I had that for cereal. With soy milk. Vanilla flavored soy milk. Yeah. Yeah. What, Path, why are you saying what? I sent you, I literally sent you a picture of this. <laughs> Mika, since you're playing Undertale, can you change the stream category? Uh, yes, I can. I just wish I knew how to do that. I thought it was a joke. No. <laughs> Me? Joking? Nah, I'm kidding. It was a joke. It was a joke. It was a joke. Are you playing the new Pokemon DLC? They brought back Esper. No, I've been playing Pokemon Go. My Esper has 45 candies, actually, so very close to evolving. I'm very happy. I didn't know Mika was a soy boy. I will leave stream shortly. It used to be worse. I used to drink Soylent. But then it started making me feel bad. Like, it... It started making me feel really heavy, if that makes sense. But I drank it for a few months, and I really like the flavor. If I'm using OBS, yeah, unfortunately I'm using Streamlabs, but I'm not signed into my Streamlabs somehow. It's like this weird bug or something. But I think I can change it on my Twitch channel, so I'll do that right after I make this PNG. <laughs> Bum, 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 bum. I still love how I drew Wismer so fluffy. Bum, bum, bum. Okay, it, actually, I can see a lot of people want me to change the game. I'll change the game. I'll change the game. Undertale. There we go. Undertale game. Boom. There we go, guys. Play cool math games. I used to be obsessed with that. Did I ever tell you guys how I got banned from the computer lab in elementary school? It's because I was gaming when I was supposed to be doing all the right type. Do they still teach kids how to type on a keyboard? Like, genuine question. Because I feel like Gen Z, we're going to really pop off with our typing speed and our computer knowledge, except for me, of course. But, uh, this new generation of kids, Gen Alpha. Oh, they do? Okay, sweet. Do they teach them how to type on an iPad? I'm actually so curious. Oh, thanks for the bits, Chuck or Lil. Mika, I was playing Pokemon Go last month and I was trying to watch the SCP episode where Whisper was mentioned a single one popped up and I caught it first try. Hell yeah. My second Galarian Zapdos showed up yesterday, um, but since I already used my Master Ball in a Galarian Zapdos, it ran away. I got two rolls of, with the ball though, which was exciting, but... So I actually bought the timed research. Like, I actually spent $10 to be able to get the, the research for the, for the other Pokeball. You know what I mean? Or the Master Ball, the other Master Ball. Okay. Sweet. So now, now we have a giant hole in our screen. Check this out, guys. Huh? Boom. Right? Are we not the most resourceful bunch? <laughs> Are we not the most resourceful bunch? Now I just need to figure out a way to... Oh, I know what to do. Okay, we're gonna close the relaxing game music. There we go. Now we can play Undertale, guys. We did it. Look, huh? Undertale. <laughs> now I just need to put my PNG tuber up top. There we go. Look, guys, come on, huh? Come on. This is great. We're going to have a great time. Look at us. Oh, okay. So the the 
stream avatars needs to go here. Boom. Look at us, huh? Are we not the most resourceful bunch on the internet? Are we not the most resourceful? Guys, what did I say? <laughs> we so up right now. <laughs> all I'm thinking about is, <laughs> all I'm thinking about is, Mom, I want Undertale. We have Undertale at home. <laughs> Howdy! I'm Flowey, Flowey the Flower. Hee hee hee! <laughs> Most Skeptic's dream setup ever, I love it. Why'd you make me introduce myself? It's rude to act like you don't know who I am. Someone ought to teach you proper manners. I guess little old me will have to do. Ready? Here we go! See that heart? That is your soul. The very culmination of your being. Your soul starts off weak, but can grow strong if you gain a lot of LV. I feel like this flowy guy has kind of like uh, an Irish accent a little bit, maybe. <laughs> What's LV stand for? Why love, of course. You want some love, don't you? Don't worry, I'll share some with you. Yes, give me the love. Down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around. Get as many as you can. Oh. You idiot. In this world, it's kill or be killed. Why would anyone pass up an opportunity like this? Die. We just got betrayed, guys. But it's okay. I remember this part, luckily. I remember this part was, was hard. It was hard. What a terrible creature. Torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Ah, do not be afraid, my child. I think we do better. <clears throat> I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. Yes, mommy. This way. I actually love Toriel. I remember her too, so... The shadow of the ruins looms above, filling you with determination. You should give Toriel the Markiplier voice. <laughs> sure, yeah. Ah! <laughs> I thought I reset this. Give me a second, guys. If you saw that, no, you didn't. Undertale. All right, and then hide the wind, hide the display. Volume mixer. Perfect. Okay. I just need to see how to reset my little file. I don't want to continue. I want to delete. Maybe I have to uninstall it. Question mark? Hmm. <laughs> no. The name has already been chosen. Most productive Mika stream. <laughs> We're doing great, guys. Wait, what happened? Oh, don't worry about it. The other option, that's not new game. Oh. Oh, so how do we change our Undertale name? I'm gonna have to Google this. How to change name in Undertale. Okay. 
Mika, you should really test this off stream. Yeah, no, you right. But we're just gonna try one thing. We're gonna try percent app data percent. Okay. Thanks for the bits, Mr. Dwip. Uh, okay, we're gonna go to local. Local, local, local. Where's local? slash Undertale. Okay, that's not bringing anything up. Uh, okay. App data. Local. Where is that? Never seen someone almost dox themselves this many times in an hour. Guys, what if we just play more cat game? And what if we do Undertale next week? <laughs> just, uh, just putting that out there. What do you guys think? Yes? Sounds like, yeah, cat game. <laughs> I love cat game. Okay, yeah. I think, you know what? I think, you know what? We're gonna do that, guys. We're gonna do more cat game. We can play cats in Paris. Or cats hiding in Paris. And then I'll set up Undertale for next week. And then we'll do an Undertale playthrough. Cat game has less stress. Oh, absolutely. All right, let's uh bring back the little... The little music we can have undertale at home we can do the undertale ost um skip that no this isn't what i want i want like um undertale undertale chill hop There we go. Okay. Now we're going to get our window capture up and running for a cat game. Which I think we need a new one for. Sources, window capture. A new source. So, <laughs> how's your guys's uh? <laughs> how's your guys's uh Thursdays? Mine has been great. Thank you for asking. <laughs> I have to change the title now, huh? Back to cat game. <laughs> Cats hidden in Paris. Beautiful. Had a final, had my last final this morning. Congratulations, you're all donezo. You're all donezo. That's fantastic. All right, kitties in Paris, let's find them, guys. This one, I think, is gonna be a lot more hardcore than the Jingle Jam one. Valerie. They all have French names now. <laughs> Daphne. I accent aigu. Actually, you know how you guys are going to be able to see the names? Is if I just... For this time and this time only. Move myself right. Here. And then if I find a cat... Eloise. Oh. Okay, no, you still can't. Yeah, I have traveled. 
Whoa! Did a kickflip. Isadore. Tie bout. More like is adorable. Anelk. I'm so sorry if I butcher all these French names. Zelly. Zelly is cute. I actually, I'm going to write that down. Ha ha ha. I am so sorry if I butcher all these French names. Yvette. Ninon. Ninon is cute. Corinne. Edward. <laughs> Mika, I'm back because I heard you dox yourself. You need to end the stream, delete the VOD, and then start up stream again. Is that what, is that, like, is that real? Oh, okay, yeah, no. Don't worry, I actually didn't dox myself. Almost. Beatrice. Desiree. Jocelyn. Maurice. Jules. Leon. Sylvie. I actually have a pretty great French accent. Um, I've been on Duolingo for like 200 something days now. So, dude, I was gone for 20 minutes. This is like babysitting a toddler. <laughs> I read the new Twitch rule. When is Mika showing his melons? What? What is the new Twitch rule? And what melons? Clotte deal. Odette. Mika, are you French? I am actually. Didier. Dominique. You can have artistic nudity now? What? Do not check the art. That is crazy. What? No way. You can pole dance now. Don't sound so excited. <laughs> I'm not excited. I'm actually kind of shocked. Yeah, do not check just chatting either. That is wild. Claude. So what's gonna happen to just like random people who are like not in the market for looking at melons who just like wanna browse the just chatting? Like what if a 12 year old is just like, I just wanna browse just chatting? Philippe. Is there an age limit? Did they introduce an age limit for Twitch as well? Which no one is gonna follow, let's be honest. I mean, I made my first like internet accounts when I was like seven, six. I'm doing this bit where I'm trying to get a mega long Duolingo streak, not learning, just doing it for the funny. What language are you learning, Meepers? Stefan, Bernard, Thierry, Yves. 13. I feel like Twitch is going to get a lawsuit. Yeah, I feel like, I mean, maybe it's just me, but I feel like having nudity on the platform where lots of kids are is not a good idea. Giselle. Yannick. Soul Saturns. Okay, curiosity is getting the best of me. I'm looking. No, don't, because then I'm going to get curious. Virginie. Martine. Olivier. Forsyth. Laurette. Denis. I feel like French names are really good for cats. Because I feel like cats kind of embody the French mentality. Clemence. I'm going to write down Forsyth. That's such a hard name. Forsyth. If you get curious, don't do it on stream. The shit they draw on art is gross. I'm not gonna, uh, no, there's no way I'm looking. No way, Jose. Patrice. Can you imagine naming your cat Ludwig, then one day you just hear your cat go, boys. 
That would actually be awesome. Oh, thank you so much for the uh, gifted subs, Dark Dark Tezuric. Tezuric? Tezuric? Thank you, I appreciate that. My class barely knows any Spanish, and she just told us to whip up Google Translate. That's wild. Josette. Christon. Veronique. Alain. Violet. When did this uh, artistic nudity thing happen? And what was the reasoning behind it? It's very confusing. I thought people really liked the new Twitch CEO. Like I thought they were like, oh yeah, he's making good decisions and stuff. Just very recently. Happened like the other day. I almost feel like, what if I, <laughs> what if I need to, eh, well, I'll keep my eyes on it. I just, it's kind of a weird feeling to learn about that, to be honest. It's kind of like, if I'm streaming on this website and then like, if I'm bringing people to this website, like what if I'm bringing like someone who should not be looking at that kind of thing onto this website and then they go look at other things that they should not be looking on. It's because some woman did a topless stream and Twitch changed the rules in response to the backlash. I don't know. I feel like... Because it's like, I don't like telling people what to do. Like, I feel like if people want to... Mika streams is a gateway drug. Yeah, actually, I just straight up went gateway drug mentality. But I feel like if someone wants to do a topless stream and earn money from it, I feel like they should be able to do that. Right? Like, especially if a... If like a person who does have melons wants to do a melon stream. Like if you've got it, use it type of thing. Like I'm very pro like, you know, slay, get your bag, do what you gotta do. But I wish there was a better way to do it, right? Like I almost wonder if there can be like a process where you have to verify your ID, which is not even like a, an uncommon thing. Like for lots of online banking, you have to like send your ID card and like verify your age and stuff. And like a human actually will like verify it. Quantum. Odile. Brigitte. Theo. I think they should have a completely purple thumbnail and verify with credit card like for YouTube age restricted content. Wait, do they verify? You have to verify with your credit card? Why don't I have to do that? But I agree, it should be like totally blocked out, like you shouldn't be able to see anything on the thumbnail. And you should have to like verify your age. Melon stream, Suica game? I saw people playing the melon game, maybe after we beat this cats we can do a little Suica game to close out the stream. That could be fun. Rene. <laughs> it's so fun. Okay, well, I, tr I trust you. I'll take your word for it. In general, your recommendations have always popped off, so... Morgot. Dude, M Morgot for a cat name? Suica is addictive. Okay, we'll do it after this. After Cats in Paris to close out the stream. I've been streaming for longer lately. Uh, which, um... I've been, I've been like a lot more comfortable with it, so I don't mind streaming for longer and I have more energy because it's like, like I haven't done anything before streaming. So I think that's the strat for me. If I were to be streaming in the evening, I'd just be totally wiped, you know? Surge. Anyways, yeah, I was saying, I feel like Morgot would be, Solange, dude, you need to listen to Solange. Solange is a great R&B artist. Anyways. I feel like Morgot is such a good name for a cat. Just like imagine the cutest, like most harmless, innocent cat. And then its name is just like Morgot the Destroyer. Or like, uh, or like, <laughs> um, like, uh, Lucifer the Anguished. Ziviforth the Demon. <laughs> oh no. 
Cedric. Oh, there's a bird. Saruman, the wise orange cat. That would be really, uh, that'd be really good. Rave. Inez. Frank. Yolande. Irene. Henri. Guimet. That's wild. <laughs> Saruman the stupid. Isabelle. Genevieve. Lucien. Hugues. Axel. Joel. Be Berenice. Reminder to stay hydrated. Thank you. I actually have not drunk besides my morning water. Matisse. Lise. Jacques. Ocean. Celeste. Chantal. What is this game called? This game is called Cats Hidden in Paris. Is there a cat on top of the tower? I think it's just the sleeping one. Emmy. M. Alphonse. Gaston. Whose cat is going like that? French accent is so nice to listen to. Yeah, I think French is overhated. It's actually not that bad. Ew, are you telling me these cats are French? <laughs> Elise. Yeah, they are, and they're also meowing in French. Speaking of Fr uh, French, if you guys want to watch like an absolutely like uh, Nanette, no spoilers for people who haven't seen it, but I recently saw the Before trilogy. It actually was like, it was like a religious experience almost. Like before sunrise, before sunset, before midnight. Before sunset was my absolute favorite. Marcel. And actually, I would just completely stop after before sunset if you're going to watch the trilogy. Charlene. Pascal. But it is also important to watch like before midnight. So you get the whole experience. But like, Raoul, it was actually so good. Je ne parle pas français, sorry dog. That's okay. We don't usually speak French on this stream. I can say like two sentences. I'm not even like a, fr I'm not even good at French. Emmanuel. Florian. Faustine. Fabrice, Gaël, Baptiste, Blaise. Marcel is probably my favorite French name. I think I know why that is. <laughs> I think Marcel is a great name in English too. Pretty. I keep pronouncing Marcel as Parcel. <laughs> Marcel. <laughs> yeah, if you want to completely fuck your kid over, just be like, name them Marcel, but have it be pronounced Marcel. <laughs> Good night, uh, party, party, party namaja. See you later. Hmm. Okay, we've got nine cats left. Bird. Nine cats left. Where could they be hiding? Um. 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 Good luck with your exam tomorrow. Hope it goes well. How cold is it in the Canada? Surprisingly, not too cold which I have conflicting feelings about that. It should be cold, but unfortunately we are experiencing climate change. 
But if it was like too cold to the point I couldn't like go for my walks, I would be absolutely like completely just like numb inside right now. I've been having vitamin D gummies and that's really been helping. Um, yeah, but it should be colder. It's like actually kind of concerning. <laughs> It, uh, it's a bit stressful. Climate change is bad, yeah. Yeah, it is. Kitty is in one of the buildings on the bottom right of the map. Oh, thank you. Bottom right. Bottom right, bottom right, bottom right, bottom right. It's raining so much right now in the Netherlands, like, it could almost flood, but it hasn't. So no stream next week if you're gonna be away. Oh, actually, good point. Yes. No stream next week, but the week after that, we are so back. Paulette. Next to the vine building on the right of it. Thank you. Ah, thank you. Emile, Emily. We've got seven cats left, and then we'll play some Suica game before we close this stream out. Where could they be? Where could they be? The weirdest part is that literally at sea level so it can flood anytime. Yeah. Yeah, it is a little concerning. I try not to be a doomer about it. I try not to have a defeatist mentality. Oh, was this the one you guys were telling me about? Thank you. Fleur. There has to be a cat in the clouds, let's see. I try not to be too defeatist about climate change. No clouds. We are so bad. Mika, unfortunately, I will be gone for a couple weeks starting next week. Hope I don't miss too much. At least I'll be able to watch the VOD. Yes, you sure will. Sounds fun. I hope you have a wonderful time wherever you're going. Etienne. I think Etienne is a good name too. Gotta stay positive. I don't know why, but for the longest time, I have really liked the name, like, Levi. I feel like Levi is a great name for, like, a kid. Meow. Regine. And this has nothing to do with uh, Attack on Titan, by the way. Meow. Oh, Felix. Etienne, like the monkey from Bloons Tower Defense 6. Three kitties in the bottom middle right building. Bottom middle right building. Let's see. This one? Or this one? Are we missing some? Levi is valid. I think it's an acquired taste. Aren't you the guy who owns a... I'm not gonna finish reading. <laughs> no, not anymore. You found two in the same building just now. This building, ah, oh, thank you. Fortu F Fortunata. How are you pin, how, how do you pin that dude, what? <laughs> Come on, why are you gonna do me like this? You didn't, derpy who, no, I did not. No, that would be so vile, come on. Get your mind out of the gutter. Meepers, how could you do me like that? After ev after everything we've, we've been through? <laughs> after everything we've worked so hard to build? You're just gonna throw it away. Like doves in the wind. Thanks for the bits, Abby. Thank you, thank you for stopping by. Appreciate it. I sure do, I sure do. I sure do appreciate it. Mm -hmm. Hey, Toasty Beans. Thanks for stopping by. I didn't know this side of you. What side of me, bro? <laughs> what side of me? Is it not normal to 
like appreciate cool things. <laughs> Okay, there's two cats left. I'm gonna zoom out. Is there one here? There's not. The clouds look like snails, they sure do. What happened to... No, nothing, bro. <laughs> Guys, what? How do you... Um... Might have to enlist the help of chat once again. You should have the seven TV emotes, Mika. Yeah, maybe maybe when I have like my off week, I can spend that time like overhauling some stuff and uh, adding more emotes and whatnot. <laughs> I think you gotta zoom in. Okay, so we'll do like a sweep. We'll do some stuff in this quadrant. anyone sees anything just yell just yell I'm gonna be really looking skibbity bap yeah skibbity cat yeah Talking about the Riz. Estelle, yo, what's up? What's up, Estelle? Take me to your yacht so we can Riz today. <laughs> oh, okay, wait. Is that the one we just got? Leaves, vines, cat in the pot. Cat in the pot. This one, I, I have checked out these pots. Unless there's another pot. In the pot. Cat in the pot. Is there another cat here? I don't got a lot for Christmas. There is just one skip buddy. Someone fell and tax the toilet. Cause cussing that has to pee. I'm more Sigma than you know. I only mew in Ohio. I saw speed there too. <laughs> Baby, all I would want for Christmas is you. I don't think there's another cat here, guys. Is this song in the new album? It is not. The new album is coming along though. I've got some songs that I have already written from a while ago. And uh, I've written a few more. The plan is to make maybe a few more and then what do you know, we'll have a, we'll have a new album. Found one. Where is it, Pandora? Hit me. Don't hold out on me, Pandora. What's your favorite album you've done? Um, it would have to be Runoff Heart Machine. The middle where you're looking right now at the top window. <gasps> we found it. Thank you, Pandora. I appreciate that. Geraldine. Now we get to enjoy a little celebration. Yippee! Fireworks! This reminds me of when you like finish a game in solitaire on Windows. 
You just get to see a bunch of like cool fireworks and stuff. Okay guys, we're gonna do Suica game to end out the stream. A little bit of Suica game. A little bit of Suica game. Wow, look at the Vegas skyline. Yeah, can I mention, I don't know if I've ranted about this already, but the Vegas dome is so stupid. Like, it's kind of cool, but it's also so stupid. Like, I think they've lost, like, how much does it cost to maintain and, like, how much energy and electricity and, like, how much pollution? I don't know. I think the Vegas Dome is, like, really dumb. I, like, have a personal vendetta against it. What about the Bass Pro Shop Pyramid? I don't know. I've actually never seen it. I've never been to Vegas. Okay. That's so funny. This is still here. <laughs> okay. Um, we're gonna find Suica game. I think it's like a browser game, right? Is it a browser game? <laughs> yes. Hold up, new transition game? Oh yeah. Okay. Might have to F11 this. Um, they have a browser version. All right. Window capture. No, it's gonna be display capture. This is it? This is Suica game? Twitch recaps came out. I haven't I haven't heard about Twitch recaps. Ugh, oh, sorry, I'm just stretching. Ugh. All right. Okay, so we have little cherries that can turn into strawberries, that can turn into grapes, that can turn into decopon, that can turn into orange, that can turn into apple. Pear, peach, pineapple, melon, watermelon. Is there a special strategy to this that I need to know about? Oh, we can't see the screen. The purple is still there. Thanks, guys. Sorry about that. There we go. <laughs> Thank you for helping. Is there a special strategy I need to know about this game? I think I just saw Discord DMs. You did not. Because the only thing I have open is my Streamlabs. Wait, I did too? Um, I'm scared. I don't know how I'm gonna end the stream if that's true. <laughs> are you actually? Are you guys actually serious? Okay, thank you, Miles. Whew. I'm, I'm, I believe things too much. Thanks, Animal. Appreciate it. All right, maybe we put these little guys here so they don't, they aren't bothersome. these what's your opinion on the difference sleep deprived AUs and would you like to hear about mine what is an AU what's an AU I'd be more than happy to learn alternate universe so what is the sleep deprived alternate universe? Is that like some of the art I've been seeing of like, sometimes we're like in a zombie apocalypse? Like that sort of thing? Oh. Um, I think as long as it's, you know, being respectful, I think it's cool. You know, because we are real people, so I hope no one is like, 
shipping anyone. That happened uh, last stream. It was like a bit awkward, but I guess it's just par for the course. Artists, writers, and such make them for stuff they like, basically taking a character you like and putting them in a different scenario. Yeah, as long as it's, I, I mean like as long as it's respectful, but also just remember we are like real people at the end of the day. So I think as long as it's like the characters rather than like, like actually us, you know what I mean? I think I might have goobered. Mika, do you know the artist Mika? Yeah, I do. You mean you guys aren't all AI? No, not all of us. I do know Mika. He's the guy who was like, uh. <laughs> He's great. Yeah, Schlatt is the AI. He, uh, he, a lot of people don't know this, but he actually just like, he did perish during the 100th episode, unfortunately. Rest in peace, Schlatt. Miss him all the time. I miss him all the time. Yeah, I feel like that song really tickles your brain in a way that other songs can't. I think I'm reaching my plateau. So I think when we when we lose, I'll probably stop streaming. But we will be doing Undertale in the future. We're going to have it be revamped. Our stream is going to look sick. Grace Kelly is way too good. C'est magnifique. Hard agree. One of these. Uh, here. 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 Oh, we got a melon. Not to be confused with the melons that are all over Twitch now, apparently. Bro, you're gonna win easy, thank you. I don't know. I don't know. I'll try. I think I just fucked up. Okay, we'll do that. No, I should've let it roll. I should've let it roll. I believe in my streamer. <laughs> you put too much faith in me. You should get the actual game on Switch. There's a Switch game? Because if I could play this in bed, I would just not go to sleep. <laughs> I feel like, oh, this is a clone? I'm playing a bootleg? I'm playing a counterfeit. Hey Kai Dino, welcome. Uh, yeah, Path, I can get the um, Switch game. Thank you for telling me about it. I don't know how to stream on Switch, but 
for personal reasons, I think I will be getting it. <laughs> How am I doing? Like, how's my strats? I feel like I'm... I feel like I really messed up by having these small guys here down at the bottom. Ah, uh, I think it's gonna haunt me. This game is making me crave strawberries. I love strawberries. There's a really good card adventure game or browser that could be awesome for stream, just gotta remember the name. Yeah, if you remember it, let me know. Hmm. Okay. I frickin' flipped up. Strawberries are good. Yes. Do we have uh, favorite blueberries in the chat? What are your guys' favorite blueberries? I mean, berries. <laughs> I think I just gave away mine. But no, blueberries aren't my favorite. I think blackberries are my favorite. I really like blueberries though. Raspberries should be produced on an industrial scale. Raspberries, blueberries, wineberries. What's a wineberry? Burberry? Okay, come on now. Strawberries. I like strawberries. I think they have been making better strawberries lately because they made them so big. I don't know if you guys remember this, but they made like that gene of strawberries that was just so gigantic they lost all their flavor and it was like uh biting into nothing which like sometimes you crave nothing you just want something to like chew on but recently they made strawberries better in my opinion they patched strawberries blueberries snacking on them at the moment they're great blueberries Delicious choice. Hey team, new strawberries on Instagram today. This one's my favorite. <laughs> Strawberry update goes hard. Oh, it's getting difficult. I don't know. I think it would be cool if I could like see what was coming next so I could plan better. Not that I am good at planning, but I think it would help. House Flipper 2 is out now? Yeah, Path, I actually saw this morning that House Flipper 2 was out and I didn't want to tell you because I didn't want you to get it because I wanted to get it to you, give it to you for Christmas. You do see the next one in the Switch version? Okay, so I'm definitely gonna just play the Switch version. You can do a streamer. I'm trying. Yeah, Path, if you're gonna get House Flipper 2, um, I really hope you enjoy it. <laughs> I was really hoping you wouldn't see it was out. <laughs> That's, you know what? It happens. Jerma just started streaming it. Jerma ruined my Christmas plans. Are you gonna get it though? Like you should get it if you like, because I remember you being super excited about House Flipper 2. Like I remember you told me you were bouncing up and down off the walls. You like started like climbing on the walls and like climbing on the roof. And you were moving like 500 million miles a minute. You also like grew four extra arms. And like became like a, like a transcendental being. 1440, how'd I do? Not even one watermelon. <laughs> ah! Do we do one more? Okay, we do one more, then we end the stream. That seems right. So I'm gonna eat and then rest before sleep deprived recording. I think we do one more. 
Mika, you have to practice for the tournament. What tournament? There's a tournament happening? Doug Doug is playing it too. You can you can raid into them. Raid into House Flipper? I think that's a good idea. I can raid Doug Doug after. <laughs> I literally do the SDP maxing every day. What are you gonna eat after? Uh something substantial. Whoa! Thanks for subscribing, Finleads. Because after uh after I record SCP, I literally have to like jet to the concert that we were talking about and pray that it isn't a scam. <laughs> so I'm not gonna have time to eat. So it's gonna be something like uh something hearty, you know. No, don't do that, don't do that. Please, please don't do this. Please don't do this. Oh my god. Uh. No, don't. Don't, 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 no, please. Oh, this is not good. I feel like that's somehow a little better, but that's not good. What if we did this and just like... I think I, I think I flip and flipped up, guys. I think I flip and flipped up. I flipped up. Frick, man. Okay. Banger. What if for those of you who do play the Suica game, what are your highest scores? What's the best you've done? I'd be curious to know how I how I compare. Twenty five hundred? Oh my god. Negative twenty seven. I feel like I would get like a negative twenty seven. Four gazillion? No. Whoa! Thank you for uh, gifting a sub, Finleads. Thank you so much. Also, Finleads, thank you for subscribing. I think I missed that earlier. Thank you. I am so sorry I missed that. One of these, one of these. One of that, one of this, one of this, one of that. I think we, I think we're saving it a little bit. Like so far, so good, right? Bum, 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 bum. I, it's, it's fucked. We're done. Cut, cut the show, guys. We're done. We're actually so done. I. Ooh, that's hard to. Oh, this is really hard to look at. Oh, what am I doing? What am I even doing? It's so Jover. Please. Oh. Okay. Okay. Okay, we're Barack. <laughs> Pandor, we're, we're, you're so Barack. Oh no, it's, I don't know guys. I think it is Jover. I think these two little pebbles will be my downfall. Issues start small, guys, and then they avalanche, you know? It starts off as like a little nagging feeling in the back of your head. Then you're like, huh, I think I just got a little tickle. But you know what? If you don't address it, 
It just snowballs and snowballs and snowballs. And it just gets totally out of control until you can't fix it. That's why you really gotta address the pebbles when they come up. But what's hard is when you want to address the pebbles, but look, the pebbles are blocked. Oh, melon. I, I just fucked it. <laughs> um, okay, I'll take it, maybe, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, 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 ooh, yeah. Ooh, that's not good. That's really not good. Why did I do that? Oh, I don't know what I'm doing anymore. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. I just simply do not. I simply don't know what I'm doing. I simply just, I simply just, I think I see the, I think I see what to do. I think I see, <laughs> I think I see the path to take and then I take it and then it's just, oh, oh, the horror. One of these. Mika, have you considered doing Animal Crossing streams? I would love to. Animal Crossing is one of my favorite games of all time. But I just don't know how to, you know, link up a Switch. Maybe that's something I can consider. Are you guys excited for uh, Animal Crossing? Lego? I am so excited for Animal Crossing Lego. You should low-key get on that Stardew Valley grind. I have been on that Stardew Valley grind a little bit. Not by myself, but I have played it with people in the past. It's been fun. I miss it. I would play it again if I could. But I think it's the kind of game I need to play with someone. What am I doing? Yeah, there's going to be Lego Animal Crossing sets. It's really exciting. Oh, stop. Oh, please. Sorry if this is a dumb question, but is there a release? It's not a dumb question. Uh, there isn't a release date for the album yet because it's still in production. But I'm doing, we're doing good. I'm really proud of some of the recent songs I have made. Like very proud. I spent a lot of energy focusing on songwriting this time around, guys. Uh, we just lost. I spent a lot of time focusing on uh, songwriting. It's Jover. <laughs> it's Jover. I'm hiding in the bathroom right now, just to pop the stream. Well, you're gonna have to go back to class now because guess what? Everyone, thank you so much. Thank you so much everyone for streaming. I know everyone wants me to, to do more, but I'm sorry, I just, I simply, I simply don't know if I could. I simply don't know if I could. I'll tell you what, next stream, we'll do some Undertale. We'll do some, uh, some Sweet Game. We'll try not to find a bootleg. <laughs> but yeah, everyone, thank you so much for tuning in. Mods, thank you so much for modding. People who sub, thank you so much for subbing. People who gave bits, thank you so much for giving bits. Thank you, everyone. Appreciate you. Hope everyone has a wonderful rest of their thursdays a good night a good afternoon or a good uh morning 
All right, let me get back here. Uh, display capture. All right, later skaters. Adios, see ya.